In this video, I'll show you how to make five easy but cool text animations in Adobe Premiere Pro. Let's get started. First, stretching text effect. Write your text, then go to the Effects tab and find Transform. Drag on the text. Select the first frame. Uncheck the Uniform Scale checkbox. Set the scale width to 1. Click on this icon. Use the arrows on your keyboard to count three frames to the right and increase this value to 130. Three frames forward again and return to original value. Don't forget to uncheck this checkbox and turn the shatter angle to 360 to add an eye-pleasing blur. We have made the first stretch pop-up effect. Let's go further. Typewriter text effect. Select Type Tool. Write your text. You can move your text around and put it where you want it. Then place Playhead on the first frame and press Keyframe. Remove all the text. Move Playhead to write each letter separately, experimenting with the frame distance between the letters. This gives you a realistic impression of typing your phrase. You already know how to write the text, so I won't repeat myself. Write your lettering and set it as you want. As in the first effect, look for Transform and drag it onto the text itself. Set the keyframe not only to position but also to opacity. Set the second position value higher. For example, I'll make it 650 and opacity to zero. Drag the playhead for about one second and reset both values. Uncheck the checkbox and make the shatter angle to 360. We have made a basic animation, but how to make the letters fly out one by one? Go to Effects and find the crop. Drag it onto the text. Hold Alt and right click the text up and it will automatically be duplicated. Duplicate the text as many times as the number of letters in your word. Then using the usual transformation make masks for each letter, not forgetting that they went one by one on the timeline. Then counting two frames put each letter one after another and get the smooth effect. Now let's make a cool effect with overlaying video on text. To do this, add your video and then write text. I advise you to look for a font to make the effect look as cool as possible. Look for track matl key and add it not on the text but on the video. In effect, contours go to matl and select your text. It turns out to be a very cool and most importantly easy animation. And finally, let's learn how to make scrolling text animation. After writing, copy the inscription, press enter, and use the control V key combination to add many of the same inscriptions below. For a better effect, shift this setting so that the labels are next to each other. And also if you align the text in the center, you will get what we need. Go to opacity and select a rectangle. Set the mask feather to zero. Select the top two points and use the arrows on your keyboard to make one inscription visible. Select the two from the bottom and do the same. And naturally on the right and on the left. In the effects, we look for directional blur. Add it to the text layer. We make a blur length frame and set the value to 13. Go down and unscrew the second position indicator so that the words are not visible on the preview screen. Also click on keyframe. Retreat for about three seconds. Restore the blur to zero and carefully set the position so that the last word is visible. For better animation, click here. Temporal interpolation. Ease in. And once again, ease out. By clicking on the arrow to the left of position, we can play with these curves, but I'll just shift the left blue dot to the left. This is such a wonderful scrolling effect. I hope you enjoyed the video. I tried very hard. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Have a nice day. Bye.